Huge earthquake kills more than 2,200 in Turkey and Syria, bad weather worsens plight. Those numbers are still expected to rise as rescuers comb through mountains of rubble and freezing. 12 hours later, a second quake was triggered with a magnitude of 7.5, with its epicenter in the Elbistan district of Karman Marash province. An official from Turkey's Disaster and Emergency Management Authority said it was not an aftershock and was independent from the earlier quake. Turkey lies in one of the world's most active earthquake zones. President Recep Tayyip Erdogan said Monday's disaster was the worst the country had seen since 1939, when the Erzincan earthquake in eastern Turkey killed nearly 33,000 people. Among the buildings destroyed was Gaziantep Castle, a historical landmark that had stood for more than 2,000 years. The Turkish Red Crescent has called for citizens to make blood donations. Turkey's interior minister, Suleyman Soylu, said 10 cities were affected by the initial quake. School has been suspended in those cities for at least a week. Hours after the first earthquake, a toddler was pulled from the rubble in Azaz, Syria, dirty and bloodied but alive. Turkey earthquake is country's worst disaster in 84 years. The global community must come together to ensure swift relief to the affected region. Our prayers are with families of those who have lost their loved ones. Thanks for watching.